So you went from playing into coaching. How would you coach someone like Jonathan Brown with his ability? Well, you've got to make sure you build a rapport because he's pretty stubborn. Uh, he was, uh, he's an amazing, he, he, he just had an appetite for knowledge. I heard Luke and, and um, Simon talk before, but for a, for a young 18, 19-year-old to come to the club, he, he, just, he, he wanted to know senior players how it, was, how it was played, what to do in a certain situation. And um, he just would talk all the time to senior players that had achieved so much. And uh, to be able to coach John Brand, you've just got to get him on side. I mean, he just, he was one of these young kids that just, uh, you know, people forget that he came and he was uh, probably a 12, 13 beep tester. He ended up being a 15, 4 beeper. Uh, he became exceptionally quick off the mark because he did so much work with his agility. Uh, he became the champion because he wanted to become a champion. So uh, with those great players, you just have to make sure you care enough and guide them in the right direction. And, and I feel really privileged that I was a slight part of his yeah. career. Tough question because you're still very much involved in footy, the welfare role that you now have, and then I'm going to ask Justin this, is there another Jonathan Brown on the horizon? Some pretty good young fellas coming through. Well, to be Jonathan Brown, I mean, we, we talk about leadership, and obviously he's a great player, and we all know that, but, I mean, Brownie's ability uh, coming through the ranks, he was unbelievably passionate about the Lions. Obviously, his father played 51 games for Fitzroy, but, I mean, leadership is feeling to be able to bring players along with you to believe in a cause, and, and Brownie had that, you know, and he was lucky enough to have guys like Leper, and we had so many great players that actually believed in a cause, and that was his great leadership, is that he was in love with the Lions Football Club, and he was going to take anyone with him, um, so, you know, is there someone like Jonathan Brown out there? I'm sure there is, um, you know, where I'm currently at with the Giants, I mean, I think someone like a, a Jeremy Cameron has similarities, he's a country boy, he believes in that team spirit, he believes in having a few beers at the right time, Brownie. Um, but, I mean, it, one of the great qualities of John was the, you know, we, everyone talks about his courage and all that, but he generally, he loved his football club, and if you didn't want to follow him, you weren't a part of his crew, and that was a, a special moment for, the, uh, for that premiership era.